So this is going to be a subcuticular stitch. Here's our incision right here. There are a couple different ways you can start. You can start the same way you would for a simple interrupted, or you can start as if you were doing a deep dermal, which is what I'm going to do. going to leave a small tail there. We're going to come through the other side. Below the top layer of the dermis. And now we're just going to do an instrument tie. throw here. And I'm actually going to cut this one right up against the knot. So now we are actually ready to begin the subcuticular stitch. So we're going to start at the very top of the incision. And with subcuticular, you want to go just below the dermal edge of the skin. You don't want to touch the dermis. You want to go just below it. Let's reload our needle. And we want to go straight across Oop. want to come out just below the derma layer. there. We're going to do this all the way down. going to come straight across. Again, we're going to come right up below the dermal layer. I think this is going to be our last bite here. You can see we're nearing the edge of the incision. So with this one, we're actually going to leave a little bit of a loop here. 
And we're going to do a little instrument tie. Last one here. Okay. And then we're going to cut right up against the knot there. You're going to reload your needle. And this is where we're actually going to bury the knot. So you're going to go right behind the knot here, and you're going to come out well below the incision. So you see I'm coming out, this is the edge of the incision, coming up below that, and you're going to pull, and it actually buries the knot. You see how it kind of just disappeared? And then when you cut this, you're going to cut right along the edge of the skin. And that is a subcuticular. Can't even see it.